How is it going everyone? So in this video, I'm gonna talk about how to get rid of tonsillitis fast without antibiotics. So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel. If you haven't already, I do appreciate the support. It helps my channel grow. Please click the bell notification button so you guys get all my newest videos. I had tonsillitis for a very long time. I would say four years or so I've had tonsillitis. And what tonsillitis is, is it's swollen tonsils. And guess what happens? <sighs> there is ways to get rid of it, but the ways are literally going to just reduce your pain. The only way to actually get rid of it is with antibiotics. But I'm gonna give you some tips that will reduce the pain probably by like 75%. So the pain, majority of the pain is gonna go away, there's still gonna be slight pain. So that's way better in my opinion um, than having to deal with it. So with me, my tonsillitis was extremely frequent. Literally, it was like a clock. Every three months or every two to three months, sometimes two months, I would get my swollen tonsils and the pain was excruciating. So eventually what happened? after the first couple of times, I'm like, okay, you know what? I'm about to get this. So the minute I, I started feeling like the tonsillitis coming on, I would just make a doctor's appointment or I'd go to a walk-in doctor and I would just get um, the, the, the antibiotics and boom, I would start taking them right when it was coming on and it would just, it would destroy it. It was awesome. Like I started getting really smart at it, uh, really, really smart at doing it. Eventually what happened is I got my, I had a tonsil surgery, got my tonsils out and I've never had it ever since. So if you're looking for a perm, if you're getting tonsillitis right now, you're going to continue to get it. It's not going to stop going away. It's because of your tonsils. I highly, highly, highly recommend getting them taken out. If you're getting this every couple of months, I was getting it every couple of months. I, I would have to miss work, um, college when I was going there. Um, just because the pain was so, so excruciating. Um, the best tip I can give you is um, Halls or Fisherman's Friends. That's what's in Canada for kind of like lozenges. And I highly recommend Halls than Fisherman's Friend. That will reduce the pain, I would say 50 to 75%. The thing with me is I don't like pain at all. If I have even a little pain and it's constant throughout the day, I'm mad. So that's kind of why I got the antibiotics. But again, if you don't want antibiotics, Paul's Fisherman's Friend. Um, liquids, you can drink water, it's gonna be painful. I recommend warm tea with honey and lemon. And then what I would do is every couple of hours, I would get salt and water and I would gargle. Salt water kills infection, kills bacteria. This will help to speed up the process. If you, I had a friend that had tonsillitis. He literally left it for like three weeks and the doctor gave him so much crap when he came into the, to, to, to the, the hospital. He's like, why did you wait so long? You should have came to me after three or four days. It was so funny. But yeah, he waited so long and he's like, yeah, you have tonsillitis, you need antibiotics. But um, yeah, so that's what I recommend. Um, end of video, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Please click the bell notification button so you guys get all my newest videos.